We have a square pyramid that has a base length of 40 centimeters. Its edge is 29 centimeters. We want to find the height and the slant height of the pyramid. So we have a square pyramid with a base length of 40 centimeters and its edge is 29 centimeters. Find the height and the slant height. All right, so what we need to do first is actually find the slant height first. The slant height, if you remember, is this line here. And we know it's at a 90 degree. So let's label this. We have a base length of 40, and the edge is 29. So this line right here is 29 centimeters. And we want to find Again, we want to find the slant height. Well, if we look at our face, we know that we have a right triangle. Let's label this X. So we have O, C, and X. Well, based on what we know, we know our hypotenuse here is 29. And we know our base is half of our pyramid base. So that's going to be 20. So if we use Pythagorean theorem, we can figure out what the slant height. So this is going to be our slant height. So using Pythagoras, we know slant height is going to be 29 squared minus 20 squared equals slant height. If we work all this backwards, 29 squared minus 20 squared, our slant height is going to come out to 21 centimeters. Okay, so now we have our slant height. It's 21. Now the next thing is we want to find the height of the pyramid. So our right triangle, this triangle, is the same as this. Well, we found our slant height, we know is 21, and we know our base is the same as this. So, 20. So if we use Pythagorean theorem again, a 21 squared minus 20 squared equals our height squared. 441 minus 400 equals x squared. x squared equals 41. So x is going to be the square root of 41.